if you want to publish your transcript on your blog or make an article out of it in some way, Descript makes it really easy by allowing us to export our transcript. Here's how we do it. First of all, in your project, make sure to label the speakers. So in this one, we have Bridget and Steven. You'll see how this impacts our exported product. But go ahead, finish all of your corrections to the transcript. So go through, correct any spelling errors, anything that Descript might have made a mistake on as it was auto transcribing it, fix the punctuation, all that kind of stuff. And then you go to your publish button and then you go to export and then hit this transcript button. And that is what will put our transcript into either a Word doc or you can make it an HTML doc, a markdown doc, just a plain text or a rich text. I'm going to show you a doc because this is probably the most common way that most of you will be using this. You can decide if you want to have the composition name, the markers, ignored text, speaker labels, etc. And I'll show you how all of this comes into play in a moment. You hit export. It asks you to save it, call it whatever you want, and then go ahead and find it on your computer. Open it up in your preferred text editor, Microsoft Word, or I'm going to show you in Google Docs. And this is it. So you can see with my labeled speakers, it color codes them, it labels them. It has timestamps for every minute throughout the speech out throughout the transcript. So there's the one minute marker. It automatically does the paragraph spacing. It automatically has all the punctuation and it's exactly what we had in our Descript project. If we go back to Descript, now we can see what all those options are. For example, the speaker labels, speaker labels on every paragraph would put this on even when there's a line break, it would relabel that speaker. And then you got your time codes. Right now it was set to every 60 seconds, but we could change it to every 30 seconds or every 15 seconds or anything we want. You can add symbols for paragraph breaks, speaker labels, and so on and so on. That is how you export a transcript from Descript.